All right, so here's the new and improved um, chicken brooder. Actually, it's not new, it's just improved. And uh, this is my DIY chicken brooder. Do you want to learn to follow the commands of the Almighty One True God? If you do, go to ChristianCourts.com. There's a free PDF book you can download, audio book, and video where you can listen and learn God's laws. Make America great again. Help establish Christian law and communities all across the world. God bless you. This video is brought to you today by Blazing Hog 4G LTE. Get blazing fast internet speeds up to 150 megabits per second. You get $49.99 off when you use the code and the phone number in the description of this video or the code right below my finger here, the coupon code. It works anywhere, rain or shine, within five miles of an AT&T or T-Mobile cell tower. Check it out. All you have to do is call 1-888-306-7062 and mention account number SR2808 when you call. These speed tests keep changing because some people are using this cell and they're not. Look, we're now at 50, 60. There we go again. This is what I was talking about, 63. We actually got up to 63 that time. Okay, we're going to upload again. 18.32 upload. Now enjoy the rest of this video. That's an order, son. It's difficult to see inside now, but we're going to take a look. That's why I don't have this on a tripod so I can move it around. But I learned a lot of things so far. This is the third week of having the chicks. First time doing this. And uh, they're old enough now that even after I clipped all the feathers off one side of their wing, their left wing, they can still uh, hop pretty good, I guess. Flap their wings and get out. So... Um, basically, I, I didn't cut past the quick, you know, I, I, but, uh, it didn't, they're, they're still small enough, I guess, that they can fly easily. So, once they get bigger, it's supposed to be less of a problem, they say. Anyway, so I got my lamp here that heats them. And I'll tell you why I have two lamps. So, here's the heating lamp here, and I, I can raise it now. This is a, um, I'll try to put a link to this in the description. This is a, uh, thing for your cell phone or your tablet it has a tablet thing that can go on the end of it uh if you want to you know have your tablet or whatever held somewhere with the remotely viewing for camera or something like that and uh i just decided that would work really good for this i clamped it on this board and i clamped the board on both ends because it needs more strength um and that enabled me to leave this hanging out here where i could put this regular light on this white light and the reason for the white light is the chicks have been going to sleep it's um it's really gloomy outside and dark so I decided that I would have regular white light on um, for 16 hours and at first I tried just having it on in the morning and when it gets dark at night but because it's so gloomy outside right now because uh, of the rainy weather that didn't work so I decided to go ahead and set it for the 16 hours until the weather improves so I had to get a timer I got this whole fashioned uh, timer from Myers Hardware of course, there's older ones than this. I've seen older ones people made me get rid of because they are afraid they'd quit working, you know, in a metal box or whatever. But this one's plastic. Timer on, outlet on, so you can just bypass and turn the outlet on. The timer, I don't know if it's too slow or too fast. I can check right now. So that's like 515 it says on the timer there. Let me get my... I've been trying to clean the garage out today, but I keep getting interrupted. Um, so let's see here. We got... Uh, it says it's 4.49, so it's not quite 5 yet. Actually, I was wrong. It's between 5 and 4. So it's actually right because it says it's 4.49, so that's that's correct. Um, anyway, so what? one of the reasons I really wanted to do this video was just to uh, show what the chicks look like at 3 weeks old. And there they are, the Rhode Island Reds. They're starting to get their combs on the top of their head finally. And they're starting to change color. That one still, I don't know. He doesn't seem to have his comb yet. He doesn't look like the others. Um, I, I don't know what the deal is there exactly. Um, but anyway, some of them have white head, like white feathers on their head, like an eagle. And that one has brown. And they like to jump, uh, jump up there. And you can see they leave little presents for me on top of the watering um, dish. And... Uh, I have to clean this out all the time because <laughs> I get stuff in that water and just clean it out. 
but uh, anyway and there's their feed down there I changed to that feeder because um, I mean I, you didn't see it but I changed to the round one for a while but they'll run around in the feed and it goes all over the floor and I got them to clean it up once I took the feeder out for a little bit and they ate the food off the floor but after that I couldn't get them to clean it up so I just decided to go back to this one because they uh, can't they, they can't really seem to make a big mess with that they just you know poop in it poop on it whatever and I clean it off but uh, there we go and there's eight of them in there so yeah this is the first round first attempt and uh, hopefully second time goes better now I am going to get a second one of these tubs uh, for transferring them and stuff I cut this out with a sawzall and put the chicken wire in there that worked pretty well and I zip tied them on I just drilled some holes with a drill to uh, zip tie there now this isn't designed to be predator proof right now okay there's a couple reasons I did this the way I did this um, so this is inside so I don't have to worry about predators getting in through the top I keep the door shut um, and there's a hole over on this end why is there a hole on that end well that allows me when I put baby chicks in here to still lower this light as low as I want to with the chain so I can actually put it under the wire um, and then as they mature and get older I can move the light up and as you can see from their activity they're not pulled whatsoever because they're running all over the place and having fun and again they look like they're about four times the size they were when I first got them um, now there we go they stand up now on there you know they stand up pretty straight so anyways that sound means it's the end of the video so thanks for watching the video please like comment share and subscribe may Jesus bless you please click the links in the description of the video consider them to our patreon and go to christiancourts.com all right thank you bye check out christiancourts.com all the good stuff but make sure that you check out how to win in court all right well thanks for watching the video subscriber chicks are here to tell you to make sure you like comment share and subscribe and ring that bell and that 4k videos are good for you they're good for your health the unboxing authority videos you need to subscribe and watch them and make sure you check out christiancourts.com how to build a moped.com how to win in court which is all down in the description and uh, make sure you check out the blazing hog 4g LT internet you get 49.99 off you want to get the best internet for your livestock and your poultry you know so make sure you get the best for them so blazing hog 4g LT internet that's what you need all right god bless you bye